tonight. Let's turn to meteorologist Bradley Benoit. Bradley, those scenes we've really been seeing across Acadiana today. Yes, across all of Acadiana, just about all day long. It's been a little worse across the coastal parishes. We'll get into that in just a little bit. And the showers and storms continue here this evening. This evening. Now, at least the good news has been today is that we haven't seen any sort of severe weather, but it's been uh, torrential downpours, frequent lightning, and uh, even some hail with a few of the storms that pushed through earlier. But again, still dealing with scattered showers and storms out there uh, this evening. Quick downpour moving uh, through Lafayette here. It's still raining for northern parishes of Acadiana, but again, across the coastal parishes is really where rainfall totals have been piling up, and it continues to rain here this evening. Uh, we got a little bit of a downpour just north of New Iberia. Healthier batch of storms just to the south of Generette, moving across Highway 90 here in St. Mary Parish. And uh, these are the areas that, again, we do have a flash flood warning in effect until 5.30 p.m. this evening. That could get extended as long as it keeps raining, so we'll watch that. But uh, uh, the warning in effect here for Vermilion, Southern Lafayette, St. Martin Parishes, and then extending into uh, Iberia and St. Mary Parishes as well. So be on the lookout for rising waters, uh, rising water in low-lying areas, some street flooding. Don't drive through flooded uh, roadways or anything like that. And uh, looking forward here, Weather Service now has us in a flash flood watch for all of Acadiana going through midday on Thursday for additional rain that's going to be falling on top of what we already seen today. So here's our 24 hour forecast and uh, rain chance to stay elevated. I think we'll get a little bit of a break later on tonight, but then ramping right back up as we head throughout the day tomorrow with heavy rains possible. Also a low end risk to see severe weather, maybe some gusty winds, some uh, small hail as well. We'll talk more about that. Take a look at some of the rain totals we've seen today, plus how much rain we can expect over the next couple of days. We'll take a look at that as well in just a little bit.